Uh, we thank the Lord for his faithfulness that he is speaking unto us. Kartavu namalodu samsari kena kartavu nde vishwasthadi kaeda devata sthudi kino. We know that the Lord is speaking to us a very serious counsel. Vala valare gauru meri oru aalogi ne ana deva namalodu samsari chundiri kina da. In these times in which we are living. when we are surrounded by great confusion in the midst of god's own people deiva janangalde madhyathil veli aashay kolpamulla oru samayathana nam jeevichu kondirikkunnathu the lord has been shedding the light and removing every darkness in our pathway deiva namaku velichum pagarnana nammade valiyilulla andhakarathey oka neekikondirikkana he is causing us to see the path and move on and to our destiny nammade aa lakshyate nokki munnot poguvan devam namakku valiye kaanichu kondirikkana we have been hearing many precious counsels from god's word from the time of our camp meeting camp meeting kazhinja shesham devam valare velariya ദൈവിക ആലോചനകൾ നമ്മളോട് സംസാരിച്ചു കൊണ്ടിരിക്കുകയാണ് പഴയ നിയമത്തിലുള്ള ഇസ്രായേൽ മക്കളുടെ ജീവിതത്തിൽ നിന്നും ദൈവം നമ്മോട് സംസാരിക്കുകയുണ്ടായിരുന്നു ഒരു കുറച്ച് ദിവസത്തേക്കുള്ള യാത്ര മാത്രമായിരുന്നു അത് എങ്ങനെ നാൽപ്പത് വർഷമായി നീണ്ടു നാം കണ്ടു that they perished in the wilderness avasanamaya avar marubhumil nashichu poi but then god did have a remnant for himself ennal devathinu vendi oru sheshippu devathinu undayirun and we heard how much god is in need of a remnant to fulfill his purpose devathinte uddesham niraveettunnadu devathinu oru sheshippu etra aavashyamaanadu ennu nammal samsaarichu kondirikkana many precious counsels of god devathinu pala vileeri aalochana kelkkuvan devu nammale sahayichu the lord has been shedding his light into our path purogamana varai nammade valiyila devam velicha paarnu kondirikkanallo so the question that we need to ask ourselves is what is happening within us in the light of the word that he is ministering to us devam nam so nammode samsarikkina vajanathinte velichil aandarigamayi nammil endu sambhavikkunu ennaanu nam nammode thanne chodikkendathu we heard also about a spirituality which is after the flesh jadathana anusarichulla oru aalmiyade kurichum nam kelkkiyundayi you know a christianity that is after the flesh jadigamaya or christiani athathe kurichu nam kelkkundayi you know god has been merciful to show us you know very clearly the mind of god from god's own word devathinte vajanathil nam devathinte chinthaye valare vyaktamayi kaanuvan devu nammale sahayikkayirunnu we have been off late looking into uh, or looking at the church in corinth or looking into the epistle of first corinthians one corinthians kezhudi lekhanam allengil corinthia sabhaye kurichu kaanuvanan devan namme ee divasam sahayam you know how paul warned them about the children of israel the church in the wilderness or polus corinthia sabhaye aa marubhumilla and made it very clear to them that they are in the same place as the church in the wilderness in the old testament munari paliyadine kurichu avare marubhumi ile sthanathu ayirunnu adhe sthanathana nam irikkunnathu kaanu and we saw very clearly paul saying that he is determined to know only christ and him crucified in the midst of the saints of god deiva janangalde madhyathila ൂഷിക്കപ്പെട്ടവനായ ക്രിസ്തുവിനെ മാത്രമേ തന്നെ അറിയുവാൻ താല്പര്യപ്പെട്ടിരുന്നുള്ളൂ എന്ന് നാം കണ്ടുവല്ലോ 
but they were building everything other than Christ on that foundation. And in writing to the Corinthians, he was concerned about even that foundation that was laid. You know, he says that I have shared with you and you believed. But then now what is happening? This Christ has become obscure in your life. Your minds are diverted into everything else other than Christ in your daily life. He says there are divisions among you. And he says, you know, finally how much of Christ is seen in all these how much of Christ? What measure of Christ? You know, and that is the reality. Our spiritual life is the measure of Christ. The plummet and the plumb line is Christ Himself. How much of Christ in what we are, in what we talk, in our opinions that we make, the judgments we have, you know, how much of immaturity we see in what we talk to one another. How much of immaturity we see in the opinions and judgments and comments we make. How much of Christ is seen there? Saints, so what God is speaking is not theology. What God is speaking is not something for mental and religious knowledge. But God is speaking to us life that we may move out of everything that is not life. Yes. Paul had to address so many things going on in the church in Corinth. And you know, in all that he was asking was, how much is according to Christ in all these things? Your family life, your dressing, your relationships, you know, your using of the gifts, you know, in your church life, how much is according to Christ? <laughs> Now this is very very important to us and I know that if you are very serious to uh, you know uh, uh, serious about what God is speaking to us I tell you you are going to be very seriously spending time with God's word and reflect upon our own lives. Now we saw one thing very clearly. Christ was out of focus for these saints in Korinth. You know, and we saw it from the example of the children of Israel. Israel You know, symbolically we saw the tabernacle was in the midst of God's people. Now let's really understand sisters and brothers that this is our necessity as well, Christ to be at the center. Yes. So it's not a matter of 
just a concept it's not a matter of just a truth and principle but how real it is in my life ഈ കാര്യം നമ്മുടെ ജീവിതത്തിൽ ഒരു വിചാരണയായോ ധാരണയായോ അല്ല ഇരിക്കേണ്ടത് അത് എത്രത്തോളം ഒരു യാഥാർത്ഥ്യമാണ് ഇസ്രായേൽ മക്കളുടെ ജീവിതത്തിൽ അവരുടെ മുമ്പിൽ ആ സമാഗമന കൂടാരം ഉണ്ടായിരുന്നു but they did not understand the significance of enal adinte pradhanyatha avarku manasilakkuvan kazhinjilla we heard that very clearly adu namukku vyaktamayi kaanuvan kazhinjilla you know it was something very sacred to them avarku adu valare vishuddhamaya onnayirunnu you know something that they respected avaru adane behumanichu where they said that well that's where god is avadeyana deivam ennu avarku ariyamayirunnu but there was no revelation of that god enal aa deivathe kuriche oru velippaadu avarku undayirunnu and how true that is also the same with us nammada jeevathil adu etrathola yaatharthyam thanne that we have a respect for many things nammada jeevathilum pala kaaryangalukkulla oru behumanam namukkundu we have the respect for the church namukku sabhaikkaadu oru behumanam undu we have the respect for the body of christ christus sharirathinayittu oru behumanam namukkundu but somehow engilum there is no revelation or yatharta velippadu namakku we see certain things as very sacred and holy pala karyangale nam vishuddhamayittana kaanunnathu yes but then there is no revelation in our enal nammada jeevathil adine kuriche oru velippadu now this is what we lack today a revelation by the holy spirit parishuddhaalmaavanalulla or velippaadine abhavamana nammude jeevathilulla we heard very clearly last week kaiyaa chu nam kettathu pole the trumpets were right at the entrance of the tabernacle aa samagamana kodarathinte vaadukkalana kaahalam thonikkapettathu you know the the voice of god was coming forth to them avaradathil aa deivashabdam vannu kondirunnu yes the word of the lord came karthavinte vajana avare eduthu vannu so they are to keep their eyes upon the lord avar avare kannu karthavinte mel veikkanamayi and they were also to hear the lord two things adhe pole karthavinte shabdathe avar shravikkendadayittundayi now these two things are very important in our life ee rendu karyangal nammude jeevathil valare pradhanyam arhikkunnathu so it's not a matter that we can just share in our gatherings but it's a matter to be lived in our life nammude koodi varavukalukke karyangale pangu vekkina karyamalla adilu upariyayittu nammude anandana jeevathil nam jeevikkendadana deivoja it's a matter of keeping our focus on the lord and hearing him karthavinte mel nammude shraddhe chelluthi nam karthavinte shabdam kelkkendadana you know as I, we shared last week i mean actually nam kettathu pole you know we see the large place of the holy spirit in the letter of paul to the corinthians apostle paulus and the jew there parishuddhaalmaavil undayirna veliya aa sthanathe kurichu nam kaanunnathu at 53 times he uses the word spirit and spiritual aalmaava aalmiyam enna vaakkale 53 pravashyam nan ilayil upayogichu the apostle paul had to use that word endonaana paulus ee vaakkale aavartichu upayogichathu again and again the word spiritual or spirit ആത്മാവ് ആത്മീയം ഈ വാക്കുകൾ എന്തുകൊണ്ടാണ് ആവർത്തിച്ച് ഉപയോഗിച്ചത് ദ റീസൺ ഇസ് ദ മൂഡ് ഔട്ട് ഫ്രം ദ സ്പിരിറ്റ് ആൻഡ് ദ സ്പിരിച്വൽ ടു ദാറ്റ് വിച്ച് ഇസ് ഓഫ് ദ സോൾ ആൻഡ് ദാറ്റ് വിച്ച് ഇസ് ഓഫ് ദ നാച്ചുറൽ ആത്മാവിൽ നിന്നും ആത്മീയമാതിൽ നിന്നും അവർ പ്രാണന്റെ കാര്യങ്ങളിലേക്കും അതുപോലെ പ്രാകൃതമായ കാര്യങ്ങളിലേക്കും തിരിഞ്ഞതായിരുന്നു അതിന്റെ കാരണം നൗ ദിസ് ഇസ് എ ഗ്രേറ്റ് റിയാലിറ്റി ടുഡേ amongst the god's people in the deva janangalde madhyathil idu oru yaatharthyam thanneyana spiritual declension and the strength of the soul aalmi adhapadanu adu pole pranande shakti adhigamayi deva janangalde madhyathil kadannu vannirundu yes they are there's a spiritual declension deva janangalde madhyathil aalmi adhapadanu undu and the weakness belahinade undu where the soul has become strong adagonde manushinte prana mangala shaktamayi thirunnu this is what paul was addressing in the letter to the corinthians idana corinthian lekhanathile paulos abhisambodhana cheynadu and so we see the the mind of paul or the burden of the apostle was that there may be a illumination in the spiritual mind of these believers apostle chinde allengil bharam അവരുടെ ജീവിതത്തിൽ ഒരു ആത്മീയ പ്രകാശനം ഉണ്ടാകണമെന്നുള്ളതായിരുന്നു 
ുംപരിയായിട്ടുണ്ടോ many things Uh, we do uh, quote unquote as a spiritual behavior aalmiya perumaatmai nam pala kaaryangal nam cheyya engil thanneyum adil upariyayittu nammude jeevithathil oru aalmiya velippaadundu you know but is there a revelation in those things nam cheyna kaaryangal namukku oru aalmiya velippaadundo yeah is there a real revelation in or yatharta velipada karyangale kurichu namukku undu maybe even our worship adu nammada aaradhane kurichaga in our coming together adu koodi varavane kurichaga it is not only our coming nammada koodi varuna karyam mathramalla it's not only that we respect our coming nammada koodi varavane nam behumanikkunnu adu kondu aayilla but is there a revelation of what we are coming for endinu vendiyana nam koodi varunnathu ennadine kurichu or velipada namukku undu Now this is important. ഇത് വളരെ പ്രാധാന്യം അർഹിക്കുന്നു. As we heard, നാം കേട്ടതുപോലെ the Corinthians regularly gathered. കൊരിന്തിയർ അവർ 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 തുടർച്ചയായി കൂടി വന്നു. It is not that they were absent from the gathering. അവർ കൂടി വരവുകൾ കൂടി വന്നില്ല എന്നതായിരുന്നില്ല കാരണം. They came to the gathering. അവർ ഒന്നിച്ചു കൂടി. They did partake of the table of the Lord. അവർ കർത്താവിന്റെ മേശയിൽ പങ്കെടുത്തു. They did use their gifts. ആത്മീയ വരങ്ങളെ അവർ ഉപയോഗിച്ചു. so it is not the absence of activities karya parivadi ullo kurav onnum ayirunnilla but we saw it very clearly nam kettathu pole that in their coming together avare koodi varavugal there was no revelation oru velippaad illayirun and therefore there were divisions adu kondu avarde madhyathil vibhagiyade undayirun when they came around the table of the lord avare karthramesikishtumayi koodi vanna pole you know they had no revelation of what they were doing avar endana cheyyanadane kurichu or velippaad avarku undayirunnilla let me ask you one karyam ningal odu chodikkatte you are very seriously noting down everything ningal ella karyangalum gauravapoorvamayittu kelkkeyum eduthu yogam cheyyunnathu yes brother we are doing because you are sounding very serious ningal kandu kanyal valare gauravapoorvam varanathu the word god is speaking a serious word they are gauravamere vajanathana samsarichu kondu now let me ask you nalloru karyam njan chodikkatte can this be real true in our own life nammada jeevathil idu satyam satyam alle you know that we also come namum kudi varunu we are also part of things happening in this house ee sabhayil nadakkuna karyangal nam pangedukkunu but there is no spiritual understanding and revelation of what we are involved in or what we are doing nam cheyina karyangal നാം ഒന്നിച്ചായിരിക്കുന്ന കാര്യങ്ങളിൽ നമുക്കൊരു വെളിപ്പാടും ഗ്രാഹ്യവും ഉണ്ടോ ഒന്നിച്ചു കൂടി വരുന്ന കാര്യം മാത്രമല്ല ആവശ്യമായ കാര്യമാണ് മാത്രമാണോ that we respect god's house that way angane maatram nammala devathinte bhavanathe bahumanichal madiyo parayna manasilagunnille is that all enough adu maatram madiyo that we respect god's house devu bhavanathe bahumanikkunnu adu maatram madiyo we respect madiyo. god's people and responsibility deiva janatheyum devu bhavanathulla uttaravadangalai bahumanikkunnu adu maatram madiyo is that all enough athre ullo as i shared during the week kanya chan pangu vechathu pole aalchu you know we look at the children of israel in the old testament parayna nimathil nam kaanumbo you know they 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 did many things unto god avar devathinai pala karyangalum cheyidu there are those men who were you know filled in the spirit 
and god gave them ability to even raise up the tabernacle almavnal neranje saavanodarte paniyuvan vendi chulra deyam upayogichu but we see very clearly nalla vyaktamaayi kaanunnathu though they had the ability to do things unto god avarku devathinaayittu kaaryangal cheyanundayirunna aa they had no revelation of what they were building avar paniya kaaryathe kurichu avarku oru velippaadu illai naan parna kaaryam enna undo was as anointed of god avar devathal abhishekthaayi to build the tabernacle a samagana udarthe paninadhu and several other people adu pole matra neega the holy spirit you know was giving them the wisdom deivam aanu avarku gnana nalgiyathu to do all those you know intricate things aa karyangal ellam paniyavan deivam aanu thanda aalmaana avarku gnana nalgiyathu but the revelation of that house that they were building ennal avaru paniyuna ആ ഭവനത്തെ കുറിച്ച് ഒരു വെളിപ്പാട് അവർക്കില്ലായിരുന്നു You know, we may be coming and going. Nam, kudi varu thayirikya. We may be very good people. Nam, nalla janangal ayirikya. Helping the body of Christ. Nam, kartal the sabey sahayi kudaga. These are all good things. Idalla nalla kariy mana. But is that enough? Nalla the matra madhya gumu. You understand what I'm saying? Yan parayi na manasla ondo. There's something more. Adalu ubariyadi chalo daavishma. That is the revelation. Oru veli paad. Of Christ. ക്രിസ്തുവിനെ കുറിച്ച് ഒരു വെളിപ്പാട് ബി ഇൻ എ പ്ലേസ് ഓഫ് ഹിയറിംഗ് ഹിസ് വോയ്സ് അതുപോലെ തന്റെ ശബ്ദത്തെ കേൾക്കുന്ന സ്ഥാനത്ത് ആയിരിക്കുന്നത് വളരെ അത്യാവശ്യകരമാണ് യു നോ സോ ഇറ്റ്സ് നെസസറി ടു ഹിയർ അതുകൊണ്ട് കേൾക്കേണ്ടത് വളരെ അത്യാവശ്യമാണ് വെളിപ്പാട് വളരെ അനിവാര്യം സഭയെ കുറിച്ച് വെളിപ്പാട് ദ റെവലേഷൻ ഓഫ് ക്രൈസ്റ്റ് ക്രിസ്തുവെ കുറിച്ച് വെളിപ്പാട് ആൻഡ് ടു ഹിയർ വാട്ട് ദി സ്പിരിറ്റ് ഈസ് സേയിങ് ടു ദി ചർച്ചസ് അതേപോലെ ആൽമാവ് സഭയോട് പറയുന്നത് കേൾക്കുന്നത് So we see that in the church in Corinth idu valare aavashyamana korinthirulla sabhaya kaanumbo they were caught up with many things in the church sabhayilulla pala kaaryangal avar pidikapettavarayirun but in all that they were caught up the measure of christ was missing enara avar pidikapettirikkana kaaryangal christuvinte aalavu illayirun yes in other words the holy paul was asking where is the holy spirit in all this matter vidathil paranjal ningal cheyna karyangal ellam parishuddhaalma evudeyanu nanu paulus chodikkunnu where where is christ evudeyanu christ where is the holy spirit evudeyanu parishuddhaalma yes Now this is very very important for us idu valare pradhanya urheekuna karyam aanu the very work of the holy spirit parishuddhaalma avinte pravarthi while even they had the gifts our varangale upayogichu pol thanne the voice of the holy spirit was neglected aa parishuddha almavinte shabdathe avar nirasichu yes no i'm sorry we see that even in the times in which we are living nam jeevichu kondirikkana ee samayathum you know there is so much of the gifts of the holy spirit that people speak about inna janangal aalmiya varangale kurichu valare adhigam samsaarikkarunnu and yet we see such an insensitivity to the voice of the spirit in the midst of god's people angane aanangal theyindha deiva janangalde madhyathile parishuddha aalmavinodulla aa samvedana shilathade koravu namu kaanuvan kayi they had the gifts of the holy spirit in the midst of them deiva janangalde madhyathile aalmiya varangal undu but we see very clearly nal valare vyaktamaayi naan kaanunnathu as paul writes this letter to the corinthians corinthirkka paulus eludunnathu pole no one was hearing the voice of the spirit almavinte shabdathe aarum shravikkunnilla in an inward way aandarigamaya shabdathe aarum shravikkunnilla sometimes we wonder 
ചില സമയത്താണ് അത് നമ്മൾ അത്ഭുതപ്പെടുത്തും ദൈവത്തിന്റെ പരിശുദ്ധാത്മാവ് ഒരു വ്യക്തിയിൽ സംസാരിക്കുന്നെങ്കിൽ എങ്ങനെ ആ വ്യക്തി ഇങ്ങനെ പെരുമാറാൻ കഴിയുമെന്ന അങ്ങനെയുള്ള പരസ്പര വിരുദ്ധത പലപ്പോഴും ഇത് നമുക്ക് ചുറ്റിലും കാണുവാൻ നമ്മുടെ ജീവിതത്തിൽ എങ്ങനെയാണെന്ന് നാം ഒന്ന് വിചിന്തനം ചെയ്യേണ്ടതാണ് നാം കേട്ടതുപോലെ നമ്മുടെ ജീവിതത്തിൽ especially in this present dispensation nam jeevichondirikkunna ee vartamana yugathil deceiving spirits are invading this world vanchine vanchikunna aalmaakal ee logathe adhikramichu kondirikkunnu and activity shall be to such an extent aa shatruvinte pravartanam the lord jesus christ if it is possible if it were possible they will deceive the very elect kartha paranju pole kaliyumengil വൃതന്മാരെ പോലും തെറ്റിച്ചു കളയാൻ ഈ ആത്മാക്കൾ ശ്രമിക്കും ഞാൻ ആ വേദഭാഗത്തേക്ക് ആഗ്രഹിക്കുന്നു <clears throat> I would like to read from verse 21 and they will come back to the Bible and I'll pray for them shall be great tribulation such as was not since the beginning of the world to this time no nor ever shall be and except those days shall be shortened there should no flesh be saved but for the elect sake those days shall be shortened logaramba mudal innu varey sambhavichittillathu ini mel sambhavikkathumaya valiya kashtam annu undagum aa naalgal churungaadirnal oru jadavum rakshikapadugilla vridharmar nimittamo aa naalgal churungu then if any man shall say unto you lo christ here is christ or there believe it not anna aaran ningalode ida christu ivide alla avade ennu parnal vishwasikkaradu for there shall arise false christ and false prophets and shall show great signs and wonders in so much that if it were possible they shall deceive the very elect kalla kristukalum kalla pravajanmaru elnete kaliyengal vidarmareyi tetipanai veliya adayalangalum albhudangalum kaanikku you know one of the things that we see in matthew 24 is when the lord speaks about the end times he uses the word deceive so many times matthai swishesh 24 adhyayathil andhya naalukale kurichu karthavu parayumbol ee oru kaaryam than parayunnathu ee aaru ningale vanjikkaadirpan sukshikkana you know and we need to realize you know one of the most important works of the enemy in this end times would be to deceive god's people nam manasilakkanda oru kaaryam illa ee even the very remnant or the elect of god shatruvante etum veliya tandra deiva janangale vanjikka ennalladana kaliyengal vidarnmare polum tetichu kalavana shramikkanam shraddhayode kelkka may the lord open our ears to hear his voice deivathinte shabdam kelkkuvan deiva nammada kaadukale thurakkumaaraga yes now the most outstanding and definite form of deception is the simulation replication imitation or emulation of the holy spirit shatruvante etum veliya vanchanayoda tantram deiva janangalde jeevathile aalmaavane anigarikkuka ennadan you know that's why the lord says lo here is christ adagondana and there is christ christu ivide christu avade ennu parnal ningal vishwasikkaradu 
false christ and false prophets enna than paranjathu kalla christukalum kalla pravajaganmarum ezhunnelu yes now as we heard nam kettathu pole you know we depend so much on the holy spirit in this age ee yugathile nammal aalmi jeevithanaya adhigam aashrayikkanadhu parishuddha aathmaavu what jesus said it is good that i go adondana karthaa paranju naan povunnathu nallathu it's good for you adana ningalku nallathu when i am gone i will send you the holy spirit endondanal naan poyal naan parishuddha aathmaavu so we see how important is the holy spirit for a new testament believer adagonda pudhiya neemathulla oru vishwasikku parishuddha aathmaavu etra pradhanyam irukkum we depend on the holy spirit parishuddha aathmaavulana naam the holy spirit was poured out on the day of pentecost pentecost devasam parishuddha aathmaavu nammude mel parayappadu we are born again by the spirit naam parishuddha aathmaavunala veendum janichathu the spirit indwells in us parishuddha aathmaavu nammil aavasikkunnu you know how much we depend upon the holy spirit nam etrathalam parishuddhaalmavil we depend upon the holy spirit for everything in yeah. our daily life nammude anadana jeevathil ellathramaayittu nam parishuddhaalmavil the holy spirit especially for the knowledge of christ the christuvinte parijnanathinaayi nam parishuddhaalmavil aashrayikkanadunda amen now the very holy spirit on whom we depend upon nam aashrayikkanda to have an understanding of the lord karthamane kurichulla agrahyathinu nam aashrayikkanda holy spirit aa parishuddha aathmaavine has become a simulation adu adeyana shatru vanjana aathmaavu anigirikkunnathu that is adu athra veliya oru vanjanaya the evil spirits will work as or you know imitate the holy spirit duraal maakal parishuddhaalmaavine pole pravartikam illengil parishuddhaalmaavine pole anugirichu pravartikam we depend upon the holy spirit naan parishuddhaalmaavulana aashrayikkanadu and now that the holy spirit is being imitated by the evil spirits anal adhe parishuddhaalmaavine ippol duraal maakal anugirikkunnu how dangerous it is going to be for us in these end time adha endi naalil namak etra aavalkaramaa oru kaaryam if you are able to see it by the spirit almavanal ee kaaryam ningal kaanuvan kaniyunnundo ennu enikku ariyilla the true spirit yathartha the holy spirit devathinte parishuddha almavu is assailed by attacked by the evil spirits duralmaakalal inna aakramikkapadum by imitation anugarnathilude ani aakramana nadakkum you know these spirits this evil powers imitate and that's the way they attack the holy spirit ee dural maakal dushta shaktigal aalmaavine anugarikkunnadanale aalmaavine aakramikkun and god's people devajanam usually think that sadharana ga chindikkunnathu imitation is the true spirit ee duralmaakal da anugarnathe avar parishuddhaalmaayavai karudun yes do you understand what i'm saying naan parayunnathu ningal manasaavunnundo this is the cause we have a spal- false spirituality adagondana inna tetraya oru vyajamaaya aalmiyathu ullathu and as we heard towards the end avasanamaayi nam kettathu pole a subtle form is to push the secondary spiritual things almiyamai randa sthanathekku aayir sthanathayirikkunna kaaryangale pradhamamaya sthanathekku kondu varunnathana ee veliya tantra or prathama sthanam ki jochini aarthi now when i said secondary ivide njana some people did not understand it rightly ആത്മീയമായ രണ്ടാം സ്ഥാനത്തുള്ള കാര്യങ്ങൾ പറഞ്ഞപ്പോൾ അതിനെ ചില നന്നായി മനസ്സിലാക്കിയില്ല നൗ देयर इज പ്രൈമറി പ്രാഥമികമായത് which is this call of god in christ അത് ദൈവത്തിലുള്ള ഈ വിളിയാണ് നൗ देयर ആർ സെക്കൻഡറി ആസ്പെക്ട്സ് ഓഫ് അവർ ലൈഫ് എന്നാൽ നമ്മുടെ ജീവിതത്തിൽ ആ രണ്ടാം സ്ഥാനത്തുള്ള കാര്യങ്ങൾ which is our secular aspect of our lives അത് നമ്മുടെ സ്വാഭാവിക ജീവിതത്തെ കുറിച്ച കാര്യങ്ങൾ our family life our job നമ്മുടെ കുടുംബം നമ്മുടെ ജോലി അവർ മെനി മെനി അതർ തിങ്സ് അങ്ങനെയുള്ള മറ്റു പല കാര്യങ്ങളും ദാറ്റ് ഇസ് വൺ സെറ്റ് 
is not about our secondary secular things എന്നാലെ സ്വാഭാവികമായ ഈ കാര്യങ്ങളെ കുറിച്ചുള്ള Now please understand this rightly. You know secondary spiritual things are pushed to the primary place. Adithiya sthanatha irikanda aalmiya karyangal prathama sthanathe kondu varapettirikkunnu. Now for example spiritual gifts udharanamayi aalmiya varangal. You know surely we must have the gifts of the spirit. Namak aalmiya varangal aavashyamaanu. We thank God for we are baptized in the Holy Spirit. Parishuddhaalmaavanal naam naranya snanam prabhichirikkan adinayittu. You know we can speak in tongues. Namak anivashil samshayam. We can have some gifts. Aalmi varangal namakunda. But remember one thing. Nal oru kaaryam orkan. These are secondary. Idha divya sthanathil irikkanda kaaryam. Idha divya sthanathil irikkanda aalmi kaaryangala. The primary is Prathamaayathu Christ's life. ക്രിസ്തുവിന്റെ ജീവൻ ദ പ്രൈമറി ഏസ് പ്രഥമമായ ദ മെഷർ ഓഫ് ക്രൈസ്റ്റ് ക്രിസ്തുവിന്റെ അളവാണ് ദ പ്രൈമറി ഏസ് പ്രഥമമായ ദ ബീങ് സെൻസിറ്റീവ് ടു ദ ഹോളി സ്പിരിറ്റ് ഇൻ മൈ ഡെയിലി ലൈഫ് നമ്മുടെ അനുദിന ജീവിതത്തിൽ ആത്മാവിനോട് സംവേദനശീലത ഉള്ളവരായി ബീങ് സെൻസിറ്റീവ് ഇൻ അവർ ഗാദറിങ്സ് നമ്മുടെ കൂടി വരവുകളിൽ സംവേദനശീലത ഉള്ളവരായി ഇരിക്കുന്ന കാര്യമാണ് പ്രഥമമായ ദ ദിസ് ഇസ് ദ ദിസ് ഇസ് ദ പ്രൈമറി അതാണ് പ്രഥമമായ ദ പ്രൈമറി ഏസ് പ്രഥമമായത് ദാറ്റ് ഐ ആം ഇൻ ദ പ്രസൻസ് ഓഫ് ഗോഡ് ഞാൻ കർത്താവിന്റെ സാന്നിധ്യത്തിലായിരിക്കും ഐ ആം റിഫ്ലക്റ്റിംഗ് ഓൺ ഹിം കർത്താവിന്റെ മേൽ എൻ്റെ ശ്രദ്ധ ഞാൻ കേന്ദ്രീകരിക്കുന്നു ആൻഡ് ഐ ആം ലുക്കിംഗ് ഓൺ ടു ഹിം ഞാൻ കർത്താവിനിലേക്ക് നോക്കുന്നു ഐ ആം ഹിയറിംഗ് ഹിസ് വോയ്സ് കർത്താവിന്റെ ശബ്ദത്തെ ഞാൻ കേൾക്കുന്നു ആമേൻ ആമേൻ ആൻഡ് ദാറ്റ് ഇസ് പ്രൈമറി അതാണ് പ്രഥമമായത് ദ പ്രൈമറി ഈസ് ക്രൈസ്റ്റ് പ്രഥമമായത് ക്രിസ്തുവാണ് ദ മെഷർ ഓഫ് ക്രൈസ്റ്റ് ക്രിസ്തുവിന്റെ അളവാണ് my sensitivity to the holy spirit pa- to hear what he is saying parishuddhaalma parayunnane kelkunnadinattu parishuddhaalmaavinodulla samvedanashilathayanadu the secondary vidhiyamaaya karyangal spiritual things aalmiya karyangal we thank god we can speak in tongues namaka anyavashal samsaaram we can have the gifts of the holy spirit parishuddhaalmaavinodu varangal namukku undayirikkum we can sing in the spirit namaka aalmaavil paaduvan we can pray in the spirit namaka aalmaavil prarthikkuvan kariyum now if these things become primary ee karyangal prathamamaya thai thirnaal i come to the church yan sabhayil unda the lord sabhayil unda paattu paadu i also speak in tongues yan anyavashil samsaarikkunnu i sing in the spirit yan aalmaavil paadu now these are spiritual things idella aalmiya karyangala but that becomes primary in my life enna jeevathil adu prathamamaya thai maariya now the corinthians could have the gifts kaanumbol but they were competing with one another avar aalmiya varangalde kaaryathil anyunne they were wondering which is best which is lowest eda aalmiya varamaanu unnathamaayathu eda aanu thaadunnu you understand what i'm saying answer does it make any sense idendha but they were not listening what the spirit is saying to them in the midst of them avarde madhyathil aalma parayna kaaryangalukku avaru chevi kodukkunnilla ayiru as we heard a while back tamar alpa samayam poi kattathu they were not here in the holy spirit avar parishuddha almavinte shabdam kelkunnilla but they caught up with the things of the spirit avarde madhyathil avar aalmiya kaaryangalla ayirunnu agar nai aaya fir dubara batayenge ഇത് മനസ്സിലായോ പറഞ്ഞത് ഇല്ലെന്ന് വരെ ഞാൻ വീണ്ടും ആ കാര്യങ്ങൾ പറയാം ഡോണ്ട് സബ്സ്റ്റിറ്റ്യൂട്ട് ദ പ്രൈമറി വിത്ത് ദ സെക്കൻഡറി സ്പിരിച്വൽ തിങ്സ് പ്രഥമമായതിന് ദ്വിതീയമായത് പകരമാക്കരുത് as i said as i said as i said ഞാൻ പറഞ്ഞതുപോലെ three times as i said secondary things spiritual things are good dvidhiyamaya aalmiya karyangal nalladana we must have that aa karyangal namukku aavashyamana we must have the gifts aalmiya varangal namukku aavashyamana we must come to the house of god nam devavanathile kadannu varanam we must come in time nam samayathe devavanathil kadannu varanam we must come with a longing oru vaanchiyoda devavanathil kadannu varanam we must come with a preparation ഒരു ഒരുക്കത്തോടെ നാം ദൈവഭവനത്തിൽ കടന്നു വരണം 
അതെല്ലാം ആവശ്യമല്ലേ നല്ലത് മാത്രം മതിയോ അത് മാത്രം മതിയോ നമ്മുടെ ജീവിതത്തിൽ These are all spiritual things. ഈ കാര്യങ്ങളെല്ലാം ആത്മീയ കാര്യങ്ങളാണ്. And we are baptized in the spirit. പരിശുദ്ധാത്മാവിലാ we sing in the spirit. പരിശുദ്ധാത്മാ സ്നാനം പ്രാവശ്യം ആത്മീയമായി പാടുന്നുണ്ട് ആത്മാവിൽ പാടുന്നുണ്ട്. ഇതെല്ലാം നമ്മൾ happy we are doing it. ആ കാര്യങ്ങൾ ചെയ്യുന്നതിനായി എനിക്ക് സന്തോഷം. Is that enough? നല്ലത് മാത്രം മതിയോ? Are we not to be sensitive to the Holy Spirit? പരിശുദ്ധാത്മാവിനോട് നാം അതുകൊണ്ട് <laughs> കാണുവാൻ കഴിയുന്നില്ല ക്രിസ്തു അവരുടെ മുമ്പിൽ ഇല്ല അത് മാത്രമല്ല വലുതാക്കി കാണിക്കുന്നത് ഇതാണ് ഏറ്റവും പ്രാധാന്യം അറിയിക്കുന്നത് വലുതാക്കി കാണിക്കുന്നത് you know and we see the tragedy among god's people all around devu janangalde madhyathil kaanuna veliya durangam idha the secondary is pushed to the primary place secondary is the pradham sthanathekku kondu varapettirikkum and then they are exaggerated to be the real spirituality ennattu aa dudhiya kaaryangale veludaaki adana പ്രഥമമായ ആത്മീയ കാര്യം എന്ന് കാണിക്കപ്പെടും താൻ ഒരു വലിയ ആത്മീയ വ്യഥയോടും ഭാരത്തോടുമാണ് ഇത് എഴുതുന്നത് വിശ്വാസികളുടെ മധ്യത്തിലുള്ള അപായകരമായ ഈ കാര്യങ്ങളെ തിരുത്തുന്നതിനാണ് ഞാൻ ശ്രമിക്കുന്നത് വഞ്ചിക്കപ്പെട്ട ഈ കൊരിന്തിയ ക്രിസ്ത്യാനികൾ തെറ്റിപ്പോയ കൊരിന്തിയ വിശ്വാസികൾ you know they were so caught up with certain gifts chila aalmiya varangalal athrathol avaru pidikapettavarai and they displayed as something spectacular in their gathering avara koodi varavulla kada velidai avare velippaduthikondirun and they counted those things to be spirituality aa karyangalana avar aalmiyad ennu karudiyathu yes and that opened why did the false things to come in adana tetraya karyangal ullil kadannu varunnadinulla oru vaadalayi maarigal the sure way of all deception ella vanjaneyum kadannu varuvanulla maargam vali is the projection assertion and intensity of the soul life പ്രാണന്റെ ജീവനെ ഉയർത്തിക്കാട്ടുന്നതും ആ കാര്യങ്ങളെ ഉറപ്പിച്ചു പറയുന്നതും ആ കാര്യങ്ങൾ മനുഷ്യനയുടെ കാര്യങ്ങളെല്ലാം ഉള്ളേ കടന്നു വരുന്നതിനുള്ള വാതല പ്രാണന്റെ ജീവന് മുഖ്യ മുഖ്യത്വവും പ്രാധാന്യതയും നൽകുകയും ആ കാര്യങ്ങളെ വന്നിട്ട് നമ്മൾ ഉയർത്തി കാണിക്കുന്നതുമാണ് ഈ പ്രാണന്റെ ജീവനെ ഉയർത്തി കാട്ടുന്നതാണ് ഈ വലിയ വഞ്ചന കടന്നു വരുവാനുള്ള വഴി ത്രൂ the soul force 
Yes. So we see that we give place for the soul realm. It will easily bring in deception. Please understand this. So is the door through which the enemy comes in so easily. And that's what was happening in the church in Corinth. Insensitive to the Holy Spirit. And you know the soul force coming in. The soul that is able to masquerade as spiritual man. Most dangerous. Yes. That's where we need real discerning eyes in these days. Brothers and now remember one thing. Deception came into the world through the soul of Eve. We need to understand this. The soul life of Eve. And Satan's link with humanity is just there. How are Yes. And this is basic to Paul's strong productive teaching in Corinth. You know, and it's sad today that such men are very rare. Yes. There are those who do not believe in the gifts of the Holy Spirit. We find a sect of people like that. Then we have a sect of people who say we believe in the gifts of the Holy Spirit. And where the soul man is very active. Yes. And so we find how the enemy is so active in receiving God's At one time, even Myself as a young believer. You know, I, I was so confused looking at the spiritual realm. As an, an evangelical uh, uh, believer in my early days. I grew up with a, a sect of people who did not believe. In the Holy Spirit, and gifts. But I thank God. God changed my, my, my heart. And one of the reasons that as a young believer, I was fearful was... By seeing the realm where people yeah, believed in the Holy Spirit and in the gifts, there was so much of confusion because of the soul power. You know where the soul power and, and, and so active and, and, and things were so much in confusion. So I said, I don't want to go there. I don't want to identify with them. You know, in both ways, the enemy is calling his, his, his mark. You know, the enemy is deceiving God's people. 
You know, but the the hungry will surely seek the Lord. And I thank God in my own life that I was baptized in the Holy Spirit. And I received the gifts of the Holy Spirit. But saints of God, we must know this very clearly. You know, this soul force can be so dangerous. No, Satan's link with humanity is through the soul of man. And it was the soul of Eve that got deceived by that old serpent. And so Paul is so strong in his corrective teaching or words. He is mentioning how strong the soul is to undermine the very foundation of all things. Yes. And so we see Paul talking about you know, in his letter we just turn to the book of 1st Corinthians. And uh, chapter 11 Oh, it's a long, long chapter. And our sisters don't get upset with me. I'm sure you'll be happy. With you. you know, Paul says here, Sisters and not a show me the island and we should seek him. Verse 3 onwards, I would read. But I would have you know that the head of every man is Christ and the head of the woman is the man and the head of Christ is God. Every man praying or prophesying having his head covered dishonoreth his head. But every woman that prayeth or prophesieth with her head uncovered dishonoreth her head, for that is even all one as if she were shaven. I think, brother, we would not read in Hindi for want of time. For if the woman be not covered, let her also be shown. For if it be a shame for a woman to be shown or shaven, let her be covered. For a man indeed ought not to cover his head, for as much as he is the image and glory of God. But the woman is the glory of the man. Praise God. The says are all happy, isn't it? Yeah, thank God. For the man is not of the woman, but the woman of the man. Neither was the man created for the woman, but the woman for the man. For this cause ought the woman to have power on her head because of the angels. Nevertheless, neither is the man without the woman, neither the woman without the man in the Lord. For as the woman is of the man, even so is the man also by the woman, but all things, but all things of God. Judge in yourselves, is it comely that a woman pray under God uncovered? 
Doth not even the nature itself teach you that if a man have long hair, it is a shame unto him? But if a woman have long hair, it is a glory to her, for her hair is given her for a covering. But if any man seem to be contentious, we have no such custom, neither the churches of God. Now, you know, it's, it's a scripture portion that has been twisted and, and turned and reduced and broken into pieces and everything is taken out by the theologians. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Now here Paul talks about covering. Yes, he talks about the place of women. How important it is for them. Now, I would like to read something from one of the books that we have. And I would like to say, here, as I said, um, I, I cannot read everything, but you can read it in your own time. You know, deception came into the world through the soul of Eve. Yes. Now it says here, Paul says about head covering, and he says, uh, verse 10, you know, <clears throat> yeah, it says, for this cause ought the woman to have power over, uh, on her head because of angels. Yes. In other words, other translation in the, in the, you know, uh, it says, that is, a covering is uh, in, in sign that she is under the power of her husband. To say that she is under covering. <laughs> yes. Now, I'm just reading from the Revealed Truth book that we have. And one of the chapters there is about head yeah, That's about head covering, which most of us perhaps know we had a class about it, God's government and God's grace and God's government and also the head covering. Yes. You know, it says here, because of angels, I'm just reading it. It is amazing and marvelous teaching that the sister should have on her head the sign of authority for the sake of angels. Yeah. We know that, we know the, the tragic history of how some of the angels sinned against God. Satan rebelled against God because he desired to make himself equal with God. <laughs> In other words, the angel Lucifer attempted to expose himself before God and refused to submit to God's authority. Yes. Why did the angels fall? Because of their not being subject to the authority of God. The head and in trying to instead expose their head. You know, today, therefore, women, or sorry, woman has a sign of authority on her head because of the angels. 
സ്ത്രീകളുടെ മേൽ മൂടുപരമായ അധീനത അത് only sister in the church can testify to this for the for the women of the world know nothing of this saveyulla sahodari maathme chuvan kariyude ee logathilla sreelukku ide kurichu onnum ariyilla yes when the sisters have a sign of authority on their head they bear the testimony that i have covered my head so that I do not have my own head sisters taleyila sthrigal modu padayam idumbol ad arthamaakunnathu naan devathinte adhigaarathine enne elpichu you know it's a testimony to angels and doodanmarku virodhamayittulla oru sakshyam i have covered my head so that i do not have my own head marichirikkunu ende taleyil naan i do not seek to be the head ഞാൻ തലയായിരിക്കുവാൻ ആഗ്രഹിക്കുന്നില്ല ഞാൻ ക്രിസ്തുവിനെ എന്റെ തലയായിരിക്കും അതോറിറ്റി എന്നാൽ എന്റെ മേൽ അധീനത ലക്ഷ്യമായി മൂടിയിരിക്കുന്നത് എന്റെ തല മൂടിയിരിക്കുന്ന ഒരു സ്ത്രീയാണ് ഞാൻ ദിസ് ഇസ് ദ മോസ്റ്റ് എക്സലന്റ് ടെസ്റ്റിമണി ടു ദി ഏഞ്ചൽസ് ദൂതന്മാർക്കുള്ള വളരെ മനോഹരമായ ഒരു വീണുപോയ ദൂതന്മാർക്കും no one has said an apostles persistently the matter of head covering today taleyil moodu varunna irunna kaaryathe shatru edukkunnathinte kaaranam idana you know covering the head puts him to real shame streegal taleyil moodu varam aniyunnathu shatruvine lejjipikkum puts him to real shame enemy shatruvine lejjipikkunna oru saakshyam aanu idu we are doing what he failed to do avan cheyvan parajayapatta kaaryathana god did not receive from angels he is receiving it from the church because they did not submit themselves to the authority and the government of god and of christ the world today is in great confusion ദൈവത്തിനും ദൈവ ഭരണ വ്യവസ്ഥയ്ക്കും ദൂതന്മാർ അധീനരാകാത്തതാണ് ഇന്ന് ലോകത്തിലുണ്ടാക്കി ദൂതന്മാരിൽ നിന്ന് ദൈവത്തിന് ലഭിക്കാത്തതാണ് സഭയിലൂടെ ഇന്ന് ദൈവത്തിന് ലഭിക്കുന്നത് when sisters take their place given to them in the church by covering their head they send an unspoken word of testimony to the angels in the air to the effect that god is head praise god sabhayil mudumai moodvana vaninju deivam avarku nalgiya sthanathe avar eduthukollumbol maavunamai dei oru veliya saakshyamaan avar doodanmarkku virodhamayittu velippaduthunnu so women must have their head covered as a sign of authority as their testimony to the angels adagonde streegal adhina lakshyathinte adayalamayi thangalde thalagal moodu padam aniyendathunda in god's government there is only one head and all other heads are to be covered chris ദൈവത്തിന്റെ ഭരണവ്യവസ്ഥയിൽ 
the problem in the family who is having up some you know women had their own problems sisters had their own problems three of the person on die you know and paul had to say here very clearly paulus ki kare mara ve kaan par hai divans avarde talaye avar because of the age mood and undu than taan avar ku parayendi vanu adha adu mara ve and we see today there is so much of no confusion valare aashaye kol poyin da kaanu you know and we need to understand that god's government Namansu and Kandagari. god's grace these are two different things devathinte bharana vyavasthayum devathinte krudhaya you know when the god's government comes in devathinte bharana vyavastha varumbol avadu oru thala mathram undayikku sadhyamagu matella thale moodapadanadhu is uncovered He is the he head in the all of everything, and that's what we read in school chapter eleven. You know, so coming back to the Corinthian, uh, the letter to the Corinthians, we see all this confusion. You know, because they did not know what the government of God. They could not understand what the grace of God stands for. Under the grace, we all are equal. There is neither man or woman. There is neither Greek or Hebrew. Barbarian or educated. slave or master we all are equal when it comes to grace. we all are equal but when it comes to the government of god we see very clearly christ is the head of man and man is the head of the woman purushan stree ke tala yes now this is the government of god You know, so many people do not understand this, and there is so much of confusion. So we see in the church in Corinth, they all had the gifts of the Spirit. They were all born again, but they were not hearing the Spirit of God. And as a result of that, the soul began to project its own things. അതുകൊണ്ട് its own reason തന്റെ കാര്യങ്ങളെ now you know that how to do it today we are living in the times of equality you know in the times of liberation women's lib in the velia swadhan you know so we are living in many many things many things are happening all around us in the namukku illa pala kaaryam sambhavikkunnundu old timer people You know, now let's look at the government of God is necessary. So Paul had to bring these things very clearly. So we see how strongly the soul was asserting itself in the church in Corinth. കൊരന്തേലുള്ള സഭയിലെ പ്രാണൻ തന്നെ ഉയർത്തി കാട്ടുന്നതായിരുന്നു നമ്മൾ കാണുന്നത് യെസ് ആൻഡ് ഹൗ ഇമ്പോർട്ടൻ്റ് ഹൗ ഇമ്പോർട്ടൻ്റ് ഇറ്റ് ഈസ് അതെ നാം കാണേണ്ടത് എത്ര അത്യാവശ്യകര നൗ സീ വാട്ട് പോൾ സേസ് ഇൻ സെക്കൻഡ് കൊരന്തിയൻസ് ഇൻ ഹിസ് സെക്കൻഡ് ലെറ്റർ ഹി സേസ് രണ്ട് കൊരന്തിയർ വിച്ച് ഈസ് വെരി ഫേമിലിയർ ടു ഓൾ ഓഫ് us നമുക്ക് എല്ലാവർക്കും വളരെ പരിചിതമായ വേദമാണ് അത് and verse 12 everyone knows this there are two three verses every third sunday we turn to them na palapolu how can you miss this kaananda vajana bhagam aanu yeah for i am jealous over you with godly jealousy for i have espoused you to one husband that i may present you as a chaste virgin to christ what i feel, uh, Yeah. 
ഞാൻ നിങ്ങളെ കുറിച്ച് ദൈവത്തിന്റെ എരിവോടെ എരിയുന്നു ഞാൻ ക്രിസ്തു എന്ന ഏക പുരുഷന് നിങ്ങളെ through his subtlety so your mind should be corrupted from the simplicity that is in Christ എന്നാൽ സർപ്പം ഹവായ ഉപായത്താൽ ചതിച്ചതുപോലെ നിങ്ങളുടെ മനസ്സ് ക്രിസ്തുവിനോടുള്ള ഏകാഗ്രതയും നിർമ്മലതയും വിട്ട് വഷളായി പോകുമോ now that was the fear of paul I would like to read from the JB Paulus in the Bible. JB fir translation nan adu vaikkan thalpariyapadunu. For I feel a divine jealousy for you since I betrothed you to one husband to present you as a pure virgin to Christ but I am afraid that as the serpent deceived Eve by his cunning your thoughts will be led astray from a sincere and pure devotion to Christ So Paul is saying that again bringing Eve who opened her soul life to Satan. Yes. Satan is under a prana jivana thurandu kodutha Hawaii's udaharnate kondu vannu kondu vannu. You know so this is the concern Paul has. Yeah, Corinthian sabhaki munnari ippu nalgunnu. Yes. So saints we see the soul can be Paulus a such a link for the enemy to work even in our lives and in our midst. നമ്മുടെ ജീവിതത്തിലും നമ്മുടെ മധ്യത്തിലും ശത്രുവിന് പ്രവർത്തിക്കുവാൻ ഇനോ ദി സോൾ കൻ കം ഇൻടു एवरीथिंग പ്രാണമണ്ഡലം ദി സോൾ കൻ കം ഇൻടു आवर ഫാമിലി ലൈഫ് there can be disorder and no government the soul life can come into the church that there will be no government no order you know the soul having its own opinion you know it is the, the intellect has got his own ideas adupolana judgments and his own opinion undaga അതുപോലെ തന്നെ മനുഷ്യന്റെ ബുദ്ധിശക്തിക്ക് സ്വന്തം അഭിപ്രായങ്ങളും നിങ്ങൾക്ക് മനസ്സിലാകുന്നു എന്ന് ഞാൻ കരുതുന്നു സഭയിലുള്ള കൊരിന്തിയ സഭയിലെ ഒരു വലിയ സങ്കീർണമായ പ്രശ്നം തന്നെയായിരുന്നു people have their own ideas and opinions yes many people come to avarku avaru aashayangal abhiprayangal undayir they sit in their chairs but they don't worship deya bhavanathil anganeyulla aashayangalodana valare kadannu varunathu avar sabhayil vanna kasarayil irikkunu vannirunnu aaradhikkunnilla we see that on one side and on the other side churches you know the the worship is become a program marbhagata it's become a program of man in pala sabhagalum aaradhana or karya parivadi aayidu the board is hung outside worship is at 10 karya parivadi all are welcome വെളിയിൽ ഇട്ടിരിക്കുന്ന പത്ത് മണിക്ക് ആരാധന എല്ലാവർക്കും സ്വാഗതം എന്നാൽ മറുഭാഗത്തേക്ക് നാം നോക്കുമ്പോൾ 
Look at today Christianity. It is very, very sad. How the soul man has taken over the place of the Holy Spirit. Yes. And many youngsters are confused. While many young people are drawn into the entertainment of so-called worship. That's why we have a lot of people who are in the world. Where is the place of the Holy Spirit? Yes. No Every place for the Lord of Glory. Yes. I tell you, brothers and sisters, how much the deceiver is active among God's people. How much he is imitating. How much he is imitating the Holy Spirit. Yes. We are to be very, very careful. Yes. So listen very carefully. I am not scaring you. But there is a true work of the Spirit. There is a place for the gifts. There can be a true function of the, of the gifts of the Spirit. Yes. That is why he is doing the obligation of those things. Yes. Have you been here in the morning devotions? If I tell you raise the hands, I will be in trouble. So one or two said yes. So I don't take it as a majority answer. We have been hearing very clearly how the Antichrist is even imitating the Lamb of God. Did you hear that? Majority of you have not heard it. Five years sad for that. I am not going to repeat those things here. But if you are keen, listen to that. Do your homework. You can work hard for your secular jobs and your studies. Listen carefully. Use some time for God as well. Don't blame God in your life when you are tempted and you are succumbing to temptations. And you are defeated in situations. Don't blame God. Because you had no time for God. You had no time to hear Him. And so it happens. If you have failed in mathematics, you better do little hard work and get the right marks. That's what you will tell us today. Yeah. But... Spiritually, we can be defeated and blame God. How do you like that? How do you like that kind of spiritual conclusions? Defeated in situations because God did not do it. The church did not care for me. It's time to do some homework. Please God, thank you Lord, let me go ahead. Since it's time to stop the blame game if you're serious with this call of God upon your life and mine.
നമ്മുടെ ജീവിതത്തിലുള്ള ദൈവിക വിളയെക്കുറിച്ച് ഗൗരവബോധമുള്ളവരാണ് മറ്റുള്ളവരെ കുറ്റം one can step out from the realm of the spirit to the realm of the soul i have seen it myself in my early days when i used to be using the gifts of the spirit i remember one incident way back maybe in the year uh, 81 or 82 around i think so yeah this happened in bangalore 81 82 i was called to share a word in in, in, in a church the pentecostal church i won't tell which pentecostal church as i was sharing the word or pentecost avela deiva vajanam samsarikkanana the word and they were in the samsarichu and the holy spirit gave me a word of knowledge they were in the samsarichu thirunna samayatha a word of knowledge saying that there is somebody in the church they were parijnalathinte oru vajanam nalgunda devathinte aalma a sister who is pregnant but not married now that's not an easy word to minister aaru oru var vivahine allathe oru stree vannittu ീഡിംഗ് <laughs> and after the meeting was over you know several one of the men who had been a person and the word went around the prophet is come meeting kaiyna one no i was not a prophet anegarane kaanuvan thalpari and god gave me a word of knowledge which i share oru pravajan vannu vanda and after the meeting was over enna enna vera mattella person came and met pravajan nalla deivam enikku oru and with her family parijnanathinte vaayil nalgi adana njan paaru i won't get into the details we shared with them and prayed meeting ayi ta vyakti ende edukkalo vannu parnu things like that you know it's all a story and i will not get into the rest of it what happened was a vyakti karthavana tande jeevithe elpichu koduthu people were coming endana sambhavichanal adine shesham they wanted me to visit homes janangal varu gathered in the houses avaru ratrile invited me to come വീട്ടിൽ പോകണമെന്ന് ആഗ്രഹിച്ചു പറഞ്ഞു I'm just giving you an example. Now here I am in demand. Here is the prophet of God. Almiya mandalathil who really shaken the church. And I myself was shaking when I was sharing that prophecy or the word of knowledge. Sabaya kulikya pavale. And everyone wanted. So I told them when they came. Enala parijana thanda vajanala thanda prajanam parayam pol. Yaan thanda vajanala thanda prajanam parayam pol. I will go forward. you want me to come i will come avar ende edukal prarthikku vanu i tell you i went for the meeting not a word came out of my mouth ende njan ningal i went again to another place enikku pravajanam parayanu i told them brother this is something the holy spirit has to give now what i'm trying to say i have seen that in my own life when you are so much in demand as a preacher as a man who has got the gifts you can move from the realm of the soul uh, spirit to the realm of the soul almiya varamulla oru manushanai demand ulla pole almiya mandalathil ninnu pranane mandalathilekk irangi chelluvanalla oru 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 and i can give you many examples like this temptation undu saints of god let me tell you it's so dangerous it's so easy 
especially when you are in place of responsibilities you are known by something the enemy can so easily push you from the realm of the spirit to the realm of the soul it can, can happen with any one of us yes നമ്മുടെ ജീവിതത്തിലെ ചില കാര്യങ്ങളിൽ നമ്മൾ അറിയപ്പെടുവാൻ തുടങ്ങുമ്പോൾ ഈ കാര്യങ്ങൾ വളരെ നമ്മുടെ ജീവിതത്തിൽ സംഭവിക്കാവുന്ന how dangerous a time that we are pala kaaryangalum prandra mandalathil ulladana adellam veru anugarnam mathram let me just move on to one more thing before i close nam inda jeevithu the other way the enemy deceives today god's people is yan avasanipikkunna nu oru kaaryathil oru kadannu povan agrahi you know superiority to the word of god their experience seems to be superior to the word of god yes ജനങ്ങള് വന്നിട്ട് വളരെ ആത്മീയരായി തങ്ങളെ തന്നെ കാണിക്കുന്നു ദൈവവചനത്തിന് വിരുദ്ധമായ കാര്യങ്ങൾ അവർ ചെയ്യുന്നു സോ സ്പിരിച്വൽ വയലേറ്റ് ദോഡ് അവർ വലിയ ആത്മീയരാണ് അതുകൊണ്ട് ദൈവവചനത്തിന് and so enne aalma i felt so strong of the lord deiva anike kaanichu be careful if it is contrary to god's word kartavinal ee karyathil enike shaktamaayittu angane thonni deiva vaayathil your feelings my karyam aanengil orikkel your experiences cannot be superior to god's word നമ്മുടെ തോന്നലുകൾ നമ്മുടെ അനുഭവങ്ങൾ ഈ പ്രവണത ഞാൻ കണ്ടിട്ടുണ്ട് പ്ലീസ് ടേക്ക് ദിസ് മോർണിംഗ് നമ്മുടെ മധ്യത്തിൽ കൂടെ ഐ ഫെല്ഡ് ഗോഡ് ഷോൺ മീ ഈ മുന്നറിയിപ്പിനെ ഐ ഫീൽ സെൻസ് ഓഫ് ഗോഡ് ആൽമാസൈക്കാഡലിക് ബട്ട് ഇഫ് ഇറ്റ് ഈസ് സൂപ്പർ സീഡിങ് ഗോഡ്സ് വേർഡ് ഓർ സുപീരിയർ ടു ഗോഡ്സ് വേർഡ് വി നീഡ് ടു നോ ദ സോഴ്സ് ഇസ് നോട്ട് ദ ഹോളി സ്പിരിറ്റ് പ്ലീസ് എത്ര ആത്മീയമായും സ്വർഗീയമായും കാര്യങ്ങൾ തോന്നിയാലും അത് ദൈവവചനത്തെ ലംഘിക്കുന്നതാണെങ്കിൽ അത് ആത്മീയമായതല്ല പീപ്പിൾ കോൾ ദംസസ് വിഷണറീസ് പീപ്പിൾ ഗോ ഫ്രം ഹോം ടു ഹോം ദ ഹോളി സ്പിരിറ്റ് ഷോ മീ there is something dug there and kept Hallelujah. there darshan the other vehicle is going to tumble down through the hills you know and all kinds of things are being spoken of today i felt i was led you know all kinds of things remember saints of god nothing can contradict or violate the pillar of the word god's word you 
you know the time is gone by i would like to stop but let me let me share this with you we'll, we'll see as the lord leads the coming week but take god's word seriously brothers and sisters we need the holy spirit but there's a counterfeit going on today that's why we need to be familiar with the voice of the spirit in our lives yes please we need the holy spirit we need to be sensitive to the spirit you know otherwise things can become just a thing how important it is for us that we hear the spirit in our, life, in our individual life the clear word of God we cannot go contrary to that in the family life in the body life. Oh may God help us. In these end times, Satan is very active. <coughs> Emulating, Satan. simulating, copying, imitating the, the Holy Spirit the Holy Spirit on whom we so much depend upon. <laughs> May God help us, brothers and sisters. May God help all of us. You know, and as I said, there are imitations contradictions all kinds of things are happening but I want to tell you God will still have his remnant his bride yes yes but give ourselves to God's word. Pray, O oh God, open my spiritual eyes. Our greatest need is our focus on Christ. And, and hear the Spirit. What he has to say to us. I want to tell you, saints, God will help the church to move on. In all that we have heard today, in all that God helped me to help us share with us, is to show to us very clearly that despite all the work of the enemy, you know, God's church will move on to her victories. God is in need of a people. To bring in a people unto his and purpose. So, may God help all of us. Let's be the way of the Lord. So, it's not our coming and going. A lot of good things that we are doing. But are we able to see why we are doing what we are doing? Yes, my coming, my going. My being here. Is there a revelation of Christ? Is there an understanding? Is there a hearing, therefore, of what he presently wants in my life? I will stop you, brothers and sisters. 
അങ്ങനെ ശത്രുവിനെ നമ്മൾ വഞ്ചിക്കുവാൻ നാം അനുവദിക്കുക ആത്മാവിൽ നമുക്ക് എരിവുള്ളവരാണ് പരിശുദ്ധ ആത്മാവിന് മുമ്പിൽ നമ്മെ തന്നെ ഏൽപ്പിച്ചു കൊടുത്തോണ്ട് ദൈവസ്ഥിന്റെ നമുക്ക് എഴുന്നേറ്റ് നടക്കും Thank you Jesus. Thank you Jesus. Thank you.
He that cometh to God must believe that he is God. And he is a rewarder of them who diligently seek. Such ones will never go empty. For the words that he speaketh, they are spirit and life. And the spiritual man takes it with him. John said, I was in the spirit and I heard one speaking behind me and I turned and saw. Let's remember and remind we are treading the way of the Spirit. We are treading the way of the Spirit. We are living by the law of the Spirit of life. So it's not a matter of coming, going, doing things, but 
Is there a place for the Spirit to reveal, to make known, help us to understand? What place has He? Or it's just a doctrine we carry on with. I'm baptized in the Holy Spirit, I speak in tongues, and I have the gifts, and you know, so it's all secondary spiritual things. The primary is, are you hearing God and His Holy Spirit now? Are you hearing Him now and today? Corinthians missed that voice. Hallelujah. God is no debtor to anyone. <clears throat> he is the reward. Thank you. Sam to come forward. How glorious is thy church, O Lord. We thank you that you can transform us from what we are, O God, to what we will become. Because you loved your church and you gave yourself for her. O oh God, we thank you. There's such a tremendous hope that you've ministered in our midst, that we can all be changed with no exceptions. If we would give ourselves to you and your word, and Lord, we would remain humble in your presence, seeking you always at all times. Realizing, Lord, that in this flesh dwelleth no good thing. Nothing, Lord, nothing. Nothing in us. It's all you and you alone. Oh God, if we would live in that dependence on you, Lord, we can be ransomed. We can be redeemed. We can be taken, Lord, into that realm to which you are in. You can take us, Lord, that we can be seated together with you in those heavenly places in Christ Jesus. Oh God, we thank you for the hope that you have ministered in our midst. Oh God, we thank you. We thank you. Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, we want to yield to you. We want to lean upon you. We want to trust you at every, every moment, oh God. We want to come to that place. Lord, where we are not at the moment, we are so far away. We are so far away, Lord, we admit it. Lord, we admit that we are far away, Lord. But Lord, you can draw us nigh as we look up to you, as we turn our eyes upon you, look full in your wonderful face, and the things of this earth will grow strangely dim in the light of thy glory and grace. Oh God, we just thank you. Thank thee, Lord, help us. Help me, Lord, to focus upon you. You alone, you alone are our strength and shield. No one else, Lord, no dependence on the flesh. But Lord, vain is the help of man. There is no help from any quarter. Lord, in this aspect, Lord, in this ministry to which you have called your people, there's only one who can help us. It is you. It is your Holy Spirit. 
whom you have left behind to lead and guide us, Lord, in the way of truth, in the way of Christ. Oh God, we thank you. We thank you for thy word, Lord. We bend down, Lord, and worship thee. Worship thee, fall at thy feet, and say thank you, Lord. Thank you for every warning that you ministered in our midst. Thank you, Lord, for correcting us, for chastening us in and through thy word and thy Holy Spirit this day. We receive your word into our hearts and lives. And Lord, we want to abide by you. We want to abide by you. We want to take heed to every word that has been spoken, every correction that has been brought up. Lord, all that the Corinthians did, Lord, there was one man, one man who was burdened, Lord, by your Holy Spirit to lead them in the way of truth. Oh God, we want to be led in the way of truth as you have ministered to us even this day. We do not want to take it lying down. We do not want to take it in an easy way, but Lord, we take it seriously. That you have ministered this word to each one of us, singly, individually, Oh God, we thank you that you ministered to us corporately as a body, that we as a people of God may, Lord, take heed to all that you have spoken to us, all the counsel of God, the whole counsel of God that has come to us. And Lord, we would give ourselves to you in the coming days. We would see those changes, the transformation that takes place that you have promised even in the song that we just sang, you are able to transform us. Hallelujah. Oh God, you are able to do exceeding abundantly above all that we have asked or thought. How wonderful it is, Lord. Oh, we want to trust in you. We want to trust in your word. There's no hope in anything else around us but you and your word, Lord, and your Holy Spirit. And so we yield to you this morning. We thank thee and praise thee, bless thee, worship thee, give you thanks. In Jesus' most precious name. Amen. Let's be seated.